World War II was the most destructive war in history. More than 17 million military people died in this war. World War II began just 20 years after World War I, which had been called the war to end all wars. Two incidents violating the League of Nations Treaty occurred in the mid-1930s, which caused the reign of terror that continued for almost 10 years. First, Japan initiated military aggression against Manchuria and was asked to withdraw from the League. Second, the new German leader, Adolf Hitler, began a military buildup which alarmed France. France sought an alliance with Russia, which was just the excuse Hitler needed to begin his forceful annexation of European countries in his campaign for Lebensraum, or space for living. Also, in 1935, Italian dictator Mussolini initiated a drive to fulfill a dream of an Italian empire. Ultimately, this dream vanished when German forces had to come to Italy's rescue. Using the strategy of the Blitzkrieg, or Lightning War, Germany continued methodical annexation of surrounding countries. Britain and France pledged support to Poland in the event of attack by Germany. Both Britain and France had placed considerable faith in the League of Nations and had permitted their armed forces to deteriorate. Germany, however, was equipping her military forces with the most modern weapons. Reneging on their promise of support, Britain and France saw Poland quickly overrun by Germany. Germany, Japan, and Italy agreed to join forces in their drive for world domination. The Japanese were negotiating with United States officials for permission to occupy Southeast Asia. The United States, however, was planning on moving troops into Southeast Asia and would not agree to Japanese demands. Denial of this request set Japan's determination to wage war on the United States. Japan attacked Pearl Harbor December 7, 1941. The following day, President Roosevelt declared war against Japan. Yesterday, December 7, 1941, a date which will live in infamy. The United States of America was suddenly and deliberately attacked by naval and air forces of the Empire of Japan. No matter how long it may take us to overcome this premeditated invasion, the American people in their righteous might will win through to absolute victory. December 11th, Hitler formally declared war against the United States. The actions of Germany and Japan catapulted the U.S. into the war and shifted the balance of power in favor of the Allies, England, Russia, and the United States. Gentlemen, we want peace. Universal peace. And I will have peace. Peace of Sweden, peace of Norway, and a piece of Czechoslovakia. Montgomery's triumphant victory in North Africa over Rommel in November 1942 paved the way for additional Allied victories. As Winston Churchill put it, before Alamein, we never had a victory. After Alamein, we never had a defeat. The tide began to turn when Italy was forced out of the war in September 1943. While fighting continued in Europe, the United States was fighting a war with Japan in the Pacific. Greetings, everybody. This is your number one enemy, your favorite playmate, Orphanan, a radio show kid. A little something whose throat would like to cut. In her broadcast, Tokyo Rose taunts the 509th Squadron, saying, We know you're there, but why aren't you doing anything? Battles which began in 1943 for control of the Pacific Islands were long and costly. Thousands of Japanese and Americans were killed in combat for the Marshall Islands and Iwo Jima. Human sacrifice was greater with each victory. 
the staggering losses resulting from conflict in Okinawa were 110,000 Japanese and 50,000 Americans. The milestone in the European conflict was the invasion of the Normandy coast on D-Day, June 6, 1944. The victory at Normandy was the first penetration by the Allies of Hitler's domain. From here, troops pushed through France and the lowlands into Berlin. These losses compelled Hitler to commit suicide in May 1945. Germany then surrendered unconditionally. Following victory in Europe, the United States directed its full force against Japan. Although by the summer of 1945, the Japanese position had deteriorated, they were relentless in their determination. After such terrible loss of human life in this long war, and with the knowledge that hundreds of thousands more lives would be lost in continued offensives against Japan, President Harry Truman made the fateful decision to use the new weapon developed at Los Alamos, the atomic bomb. August 6th, 1945, the atomic bomb called Little Boy was dropped on Hiroshima. Our demand has been, and it remains, unconditional surrender. When Japan ignored a surrender ultimatum, a second bomb called Fat Man was dropped on Nagasaki, August 9th. A few days later, Japan surrendered, and on September 2nd, 1945, signed the Instrument of Surrender aboard the battleship Missouri. World War II had ended. They shall beat their swords into plowshares and their spears into pruning hooks. Nation shall not lift up sword against nation. Neither shall they learn war anymore. 